What's up guys and welcome to my channel. If you are new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'm posting brand new full length workouts right here every week. So I've got a killer one for you guys today. I'm bringing you 40 different exercises in 40 minutes. We're targeting the entire body today with this full body workout. I'm gonna be breaking it out into four different sections. Each section is gonna have 10 moves. So 10 minute rounds, we'll have a quick water break in between and then move on to the next. So I'm gonna be taking some time before the workout starts to warm up, just a quick five minute warm up to get that body prepped. And then after the workout, be sure to stick around because we're gonna take some time to cool down and stretch things out. All right guys, my timer is set. All I need to do is follow along. We're getting started right now. I'm gonna be guiding you guys through the warm up and the cool down today, but don't worry, I'll be keeping it quiet throughout the workout. Here we go. We're gonna start with some nice big arm circles, warming up those shoulders and the chest. Taking some nice big breaths. And let's reverse it, going the opposite way. Awesome, that's it. We're gonna place the hands on the shoulders, get a little torso twist here, keeping the feet planted, rotating from the waist, feel a nice twist through that spine. Awesome, going in to some squats with an overhead reach up and over to the side, really reaching those fingertips. You wanna get a nice stretch through the side. In that squat, we're keeping all the way in the heels, really pushing those hips back and keeping the chest up. Just a couple more here. Awesome, we're gonna hinge forward, grab onto those toes and drop that tailbone lifting the chest up on your inhale extending the legs nice and straight and then exhale drop that tailbone back down we're going to repeat this movement a few times warming up those hamstrings warming up those hips get those legs as straight as you can and really push the hips back each time you come down try and tuck that tailbone a little further awesome rolling up one vertebrae at a time here little shoulder shrug at the top then we're gonna go into a reverse lunge with that side reach again. Getting into the hips and the side body. Lunging back, driving straight up and down through that front heel. Keeping your balance. There we go, last one. And we're gonna pick it up here with some butt kicks. Getting that heart rate up, getting in that cardio. Drive those heels up towards those glutes. Squeeze those hamstrings, stay nice and light on your feet. And we're gonna switch it into jumping jacks again. Nice and light on those feet, get those arms pumping. Keep your core engaged here, belly buttons pull to the spine. Nice work guys, stopping in a nice wide stance. We're going into some side lunges. Again, warming up those hips. I want you to really push those hips back. Try and keep the knees behind the toes and keep that chest up. You should feel a nice pull through the inner thighs and those hips. Back and forth, nice and gentle. Awesome, that's it, all right. Up to the top, going into some inchworms here. Walk it out into that high plank, dropping the hips into that upward facing dog. Walking the hands back, coming all the way to the top. Nice big full body stretch. And let's repeat that move, walk it out. Drop those hips, lift the chest. And then walking it back in all the way to the top. Reach up, feel length and repeat. There we go, connecting movement to breath. We're gonna pick it up again here, a little jog on the spot. Get that heart rate up. You should be feeling warm by now. Breathing should have picked up a little bit. Let's get those knees up a little bit higher, guys. Awesome, 
Switching into a crisscross jack here. Try and keep those elbows up. Squeeze those shoulder blades on the way back. Squeeze the chest as you bring those arms forward. Nice guys, opposite hand to toe. Reach across, jump up into that jumping jack. Alternating sides here. Try and keep the legs as straight as you can. Feeling a nice pull through those hamstrings. Really pushing the hips back, keeping that back nice and flat. We're almost there, guys. We're gonna finish off with a few knee pulls. Squeeze that knee up as you pull the shoulder blades back. Just a couple more. All right, guys. This is it. We are ready. We're gonna be starting things off today with a goblet squat, so grab a quick sip of water and get ready to go.
the flame, fill the night When we touch then we ignite
different star Flying over streets and our broken hearts But they can even touch us We found a different beat Paradise is waiting and we bought the lead Ooh, getting caught in the mist There's so many that never get out of They're feeling the fears and the doubts Ooh, but we go and we run to the end And we run without shame
All right guys, that was killer. I hope you're feeling amazing. We're gonna take some time now to cool down, stretch it out, so stick around, grab yourself a quick sip of water because we're gonna get started right away here. Bring it down onto your mat, hug those knees into the chest, just taking some nice slow breaths, letting that heart rate slow down, giving yourself a little love here. That's it, opening the knees up a little bit wider, getting a little deeper into those hips, maybe a gentle rock side to side, and maybe coming into a happy baby, grabbing onto the bottom of the feet, letting the knees sink down. Nice big inhale through the nose, and exhale through the mouth. Good. We're going to windshield wiper those knees, keeping the shoulder blades on your mat. Just drop the knees from side to side, feeling a nice gentle release in that lower back. You can bring the feet a little bit wider and then hinge the knees one at a time. Not forcing it here, just letting the knees drop naturally. And then we're gonna go into a figure four. So crossing that right ankle over the left knee, grabbing onto that left knee or left thigh, wherever you can reach. Again, trying to keep those shoulder blades on your mat. And just breathe into that right hip. We're opening up the hips and the glutes here, getting in a nice stretch. Grabbing onto that right knee now, tugging it towards the chest. Then we're gonna guide it across the body to the left, letting that knee just drop naturally, bringing your gaze over to that right hand. Keeping the shoulder blades on the mat here, we're again getting a nice twist in that back. And let's get that other side, figure four on the other side. Cross it over, grab onto that thigh or that knee, and just try and relax into this stretch. Go hug that left knee in towards the chest, give it a little tug, and guiding it across the body to the right, bringing the gaze over to the left. Ah, nice big breaths here, guys. That heart rate should be starting to slow down. Breathing is coming back to a normal rhythm. Hugging those knees back into the chest, we're just gonna rock ourselves up. Coming into a seated cross-legged position. Pressing the palms down into the ground, we're just gonna do a little head tilt here, side to side, half circle, maybe all the way around, whatever feels good for you today. And then clasping those hands behind the back, Press the palms down, lift the chest, and if it feels okay on your shoulders, you can lift the hands up away from the back. Listen to your body here, don't push it. Awesome, pressing those palms forward now, rounding the spine, scooping the belly, drawing the chin to the chest. Taking a nice big inhale right into that upper back. And sitting up nice and tall. 
Coming forward now onto all fours, we're going to stretch out those forearms. So rotating the hands back, really gentle with this one, really paying attention to your body. Don't force anything, don't do anything that hurts. Just shifting the weight back and feeling a nice stretch through those forearms. Awesome. Pressing up now into our downward facing dog. Nice and slowly, we're going to pedal out the feet one at a time, pressing the heels down. Drawing the belly button to the spine. Shifting into a high plank, slowly lowering, and then pressing up into either a cobra or upward facing dog. And relax, we're going to press back into a child's pose, and you guys can hang out here as long as you need. All right guys, we are done. You did it, 40 different exercises in 40 minutes. That's insane. I hope you feel amazing. Comment below, let me know how it went for you. And guys, if you like this workout, be sure to share it with your friends and give it a thumbs up. Have an awesome day. I will see you at the next workout.